Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Melly Sandra, and we are back to pinch more pennies because we got this chicken. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are in need of a pinch of penny meal, I got you because we are about to take this here chicken. It's a whole chicken. Um, oh damn, he ate the whole left side of the breast last night i thought we about to be really pinching now because i thought i had the other side of the breast to work with but somebody was very hungry last night was it you no it wasn't you. it was Lalo. okay whatever food is food we'll make it work if you want to see how i make this chicken work for not one but three meals Stay tuned because I'm kind of I'm kind of questioning myself too. But I said last night we're gonna have to make this. And Lalo, Lalo said, "Ma, I know that if anybody could stretch something out and be creative with a meal, it's you. So I'm not gonna let him down. We're doing it. Let's go." All right, guys. So I do have a Walmart order coming. So in the middle of this video, you're going to see and we're going to talk about the stuff I ordered from Walmart to last us the next week. Okay? So, but right now, we're going to get the step in and we got this chicken right here, right here. So, and we got Kilo here. He's working. So we're just going to mind our business about that. So here is the chicken. This part was eaten by me. No, this part was eaten by me, Kilo, and Angie. This part was eaten by Lalo. So, we need to break this up. Do you think we can do it? I think we can. Basically, we are doing like meal prep. Because we're going to get this junk done. So that when we're ready to eat it, we just eat it. So what we have to do. Okay, so I'm going to tell you now. That tonight, we're having chicken pot pie. Okay? Mmm, yummy! Tomorrow, we are having um, chicken quesadillas. The next day, <laughs> or maybe not. I might just make it and freeze it. But the next, is it here? No. Oh, the next time we eat the chicken, it's going to be chicken noodle soup. Okay. So that's actually four meals out of one chicken. So, uh, let's go. This is good. I'm going to get this pot, fill it up with water. my freaking glasses. Oh no. Oh, guys. This is how much chicken we have from there. Yeah. It's here? Something's wrong. Yay. Huh? Beautiful Spanish thing. <laughs> what? Really? So beautiful. I'm trying to give her the charm, but she's in a rush. This right here, we are dropping into the pot. I'm gonna put some salt in there. Cause I want it seasoned. And then we're putting this baby in here. I wish I didn't lose all that chicken in there, but Welcome back to my very broke Walmart grocery haul. <laughs> so, what I got to last me the next week 
as you already know, we're cooking the chicken, okay? So, that's that. I bought, cause you know, the kids are, are on vacation. If you're getting this later, that my kids are still on vacation, so we need to fill the house with something, you know what I'm saying? We do have stuff, but like, <clears throat> more dinner stuff, not really uh, lunch, lunchy stuff. So I got one thing of Hot Pockets. Angie has been hooked on um, cheese and crackers. So I got another thing of cheese. And, oh man. They gave me the wrong ones. Crackers. We got a thing of bologna. I like bologna. Um, we got the taco blend cheese. We got $5 worth of ham. Whatever. They don't like bologna. Can't be picky when you ain't got shit, right? That's what I say. Spaghetti, because what's going to get me through um, for the week is I do have I probably save some of that chicken and make like um, uh, Fettuccine Alfredo because I have um, I have some uh, Fettuccine sauce so or Alfredo sauce. So I got this for I'm just show you So that with This Um, I got some tomato soup for lunch because we have a lot of cheese because I buy that big block and I got four things of bread so that'll be lunch that's lunch that's lunch also tuna fish sandwiches or tuna and crackers that's lunch and I thought these were gonna be the smaller ones, but now we only got eight large ones. So that freaking sucks, but I guess I will cut them in half and make 16. So we're gonna have these. These are gonna be the chicken, the chicken tacos um, or the chicken quesadillas. That's what I'm gonna make, chicken quesadillas with this chicken. That's not for tonight though. Um. I have bacon, so we're gonna have BLTs and some french fries because I got potatoes. I got some bananas if I wanna make some um, pancakes with some bananas. And, oh, I did buy more. I bought two more of these because also for New Year's, the reason why I'm broke, guys, I'm gonna tell you the reason why I'm broke, okay? The reason why I'm broke is because I swore that they weren't going to have food, okay, um, for New Year's, right? Like, it was going to be all out. And I wanted to make sure I got my chicken wings and all that other stuff. Now, mind you, Lalo's here. We're not used to Lalo being here. So, it's like... I'm cooking more like you see that chicken that the whole side of that chicken wouldn't you know so it's kind of like you know what I'm saying so I have to accommodate for my my baby being here so um and then we just had the Christmas so I use more ground beef than I usually would things like that I bought we had some soda anyway I bought everything for New Year's soda pepperoni crackers what else was i gonna have i bought two things of potatoes because i want to make potato salad and probably some rice and then um i don't even remember what else i bought guys but i'm assuming that that is why that's where my money went um and soda and chips i bought chips because oh and i bought a whole gallon of milk because usually a half gallon, Anji doesn't even drink milk, so it goes bad. But Lalo's here, so I got the whole gallon of milk. So we can have some cereal and drink some milk. And I would say cookies, but there is no more cookies. But I have this brownie mix, okay? So they're going to be good. I'll show you what I do. I do have 
my cabinet has his food in there. See? My cabinet has food. My drunk my junk drawer does have some snacks. Okay. My freezer is however getting low, but I still have some ground beef that I cooked and froze. Um, the bacon for the BLTs. I also have a pizza. I also have shredded steak. And I have leftover spaghetti. I tell you guys, do not throw out your shit, okay? Don't leave it in the fridge because then, you know, if it's in the fridge for like two days, put it in the freezer. Because um, after two days in the fridge, ain't nobody going to eat it unless they do. Like, I don't know. You can only eat something so many times unless you're really broke and you have nothing else to eat. Then you're going to have to eat the spaghetti over and over and over again all week long. But I froze it. So... We're good. And then I got another thing of ground beef, which I do have some Leo shells. So I can do that with some french fries and macaroni and cheese. So we do have some stuff. Not like, not like usual, you know what I'm saying? I can't make no fancy dinner or anything. But anyway, this is what we're doing. So tonight, tonight, what we're going to eat is... And I bought this a while ago. Where the hell is it? Where? Oh, I got it. We're having chicken pot pie, guys. Chicken pot pie. And if you have not seen me make chicken pot pie before, there is a video and I will link it somewhere over here so you guys can see how I make my chicken pot pie. But that is what we are going to make tonight chicken pot pie and all i do is take um cream of chicken actually i think i want to make it from scratch you could do it the easy way and and do it with cream of chicken but it doesn't taste as good um but you do peas got some peas and what are these sliced carrots that's not what i want i want the peas I want the peas and the carrots. Look, I still got, I got coquito from when Tony made the coquito. Oh, here we go. Peas and carrots. Peas and carrots. Some, um, either chicken stock. I don't have butter, so that kind of sucks. Chicken stock or chicken, you could just Google the recipe or you can go look, look at mine. Um, but it, it's really easy so basically that is what I'm making um and I will see you that is what I'm making that's what's going to last us uh with all of this chicken I will take a picture I guess of our cheese quesa chicken cheese quesadillas um tomorrow night and I will post it on the community tab um, yeah, that's going on wrong because this is not going to be coming out. Well, maybe it is. I don't know. Anyway, this video is getting all over the place. I basically wanted to show you my Walmart haul and I wanted to let you know how I am pinching as well as you and how we can make it through with one freaking chicken. Guys, I kind of did that really fast. I'm not sure if I told you that I got, um, tomato soup. And we're going to eat the grilled cheese sandwiches. Just saying. And the BLTs. Just saying. I can't remember. That was like really fast. Okay, bye.
Okay, guys. So, meal one is done. There is the pie. And the chicken broth is the way. This crust right here, this crust, just the crust is calling my name like you do you know how bad are you guys like that do you know how bad i want look at this piece right here oh my god look at this piece right here this piece right here is calling my name i just want to rip it off and eat it i want to eat that <laughs> mm, i could eat i, I don't even want to eat the inside i just want to eat the crust i should just buy a crust and just cook it i would be so content just eating the crust off the thing and by the way, I didn't have regular butter, so we had to use margarine. So I already know it's not going to be as good, but it's still what I call dinner. Okay. Now I'm leaving. Still cooking. I took the big giant chunk out, but I want to get the rest out of what is in here, these bones. Yes. And so, I don't know. My aunt, back in the day, used to make chicken broth with um, thin spaghetti noodles and put like a bunch of um, Parmesan cheese and oh my god it used to be so good and it was so easy and it just it was it was just so good and my kids used to love it so um that's how I'm gonna make the the um, chicken soup so yeah next meal is going to be um, chicken quesadillas and then the soup so um, I'll see you at the next meal by the way, remember I was growing my my uh, green onion? It's still growing. It's st I mean, it will reach to a point where it won't grow anymore. And I'm growing some lettuce, but it ain't doing so well. Um, but I actually chopped more off, and I have more to put in my container. Woo! I'm lying, because I'm going to show you what it came out to look like, okay? Mm. Why do you take Calio? Oh, medicine. Is it going to help? Is it? No, it's a little bit. Uh -huh. This isn't going to melt, right? No. Don't show me. Why? You're so cute, though. But you're so cute, you brat. Brat. <laughs> okay, so now the first dinner is officially done. All right, see you tomorrow. All right, guys, we're back. It's night two. What are we cooking? You know. Let's go.
babe. Here, babe. Oh, we don't have any salsa. Layla! Yeah. Here. Okay. I don't even have enough cheese. I mean, not cheese. Um, Chicken. Yeah. Oh, but I got this. Oh, good. Uh, here. 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 This is beautiful. Thank you. Here, here. You got sour cream. You want it? Yes, please. Of course you do. This was the perfect dinner, Mom. Yeah. Actually, it's four because... Chicken? Yeah. Wow. Chicken and cheese. But I don't have no salsa or nothing. But... Still good. Thank you, Mom. I love you. I love you, too. All right, guys, so that is it. This is day two, and tomorrow is day three. I'll see you tomorrow. All right, guys, welcome to day three of cooking dinner with your girl, Melly. Um, using a chicken for four meals, and this is the last and final meal. We ate, if you saw, you must have saw. Um, we ate the quesadillas last night. Now we're eating the soup. And I almost I almost started cooking and forgot. So anyway, I put some um, onions. I'm sauteing some onions and garlic. I'm about to put this in there. I'm going to let it heat up a little bit. I'm going to put a handful of frozen carrots. And um, then I'm going to boil the spaghetti noodles. And I'll be back. don't have grated parmesan cheese I only have like the real kind so and I actually bought it to make real um, fettuccine alfredo but I ended up not be not making it so I'm using it for the chicken noodle soup because it tastes so good when you put some parmesan cheese in it Ooh, girl if you've never had chicken soup like this with the broth and uh, put Parmesan cheese in it, you should try it. There's the cheese, now we're gonna mix it all up. It makes it, just gives it a different taste, like a, I don't know, a creamier taste. It's good, it's very good, it's very good. And that is what we're calling dinner. Doesn't look as good on camera. But it's gonna taste good, so yes. Anyway, that is it for this video, for this long video, probably. I don't know if it's gonna be long or not. But that's what I did to feed my family for the last three days. And it worked. So, one chicken, one six pound chicken that was like seven bucks. We got four meals out of it for four people. So yeah. Until the next video, I love you mucho. Stay pinching. And uh, keep your head up. Because as long as you can think of a way, there's always a way. There's always a way. Whether or not you have to pinch and scrape or go to the food bank or just stretch out your last bit of food stamps or even just freaking go out and catch yourself a chicken. There's always something. There's always something. So... That's my purpose of these videos, just to give you hope that just when you thought you couldn't, you could. Anyway. I love you guys. Until the next video, make sure you hit the like. Make sure you're subscribed if you're not. And I will catch you on the flip side.